Hi, it's Chris here in the 4 News Now First Alert Weather Center. It's Monday, and what a beautiful Monday it has been. Blue sky, sunshine, just a light breeze. We hit 75 degrees, which is a pretty good amount below average. Uh, our average high now is 83 and climbing. Uh, looks like we're going to be right around 83 tomorrow. We're warming up in the forecast. One quick note, we did not hit 90 degrees over the weekend. So we have yet to hit 90. And if we can make it one more week without hitting 90, we will tie the record for the latest we've ever hit 90 degrees in Spokane. A week and a day and we'll set the record. I think that's pretty exciting. I uh, love a good record, but we were, are going to make another run at that 90 degree temperature. Uh, before I get too much into the weather, I want to tell you and show you a picture of Comet Neowise. Uh, this picture uh, taken last night by, or actually early this morning from Tiffany Hansen and uh, Comet Neowise. Uh, it's, here, I'm going to put this little arrow on there for you <laughs> and then take it off. There's a, so you can see where it is. Um, you will be able to see it again early Tuesday morning. You've got to get up, gosh, an hour and 50 minutes before sunrise. Sunrise right now is at six minutes after five. So a little after three in the morning and uh, look to the northeast sky low on the horizon and you should be able to see it and we'll have clear skies for comet viewing. I'm just going to put that arrow on one more time for you. There it is. Um, you can see it with the naked eye. Uh, I recommend binoculars for a little bit better view and uh, enjoy that. How fun. Here is a look at our weather pattern right now and we have a north westerly flow over the region and that is why despite the fact that we had so much sunshine our temperatures were about eight degrees below average. That is going to change over the next 24 hours. We'll start to see high pressure building in and our temperatures will definitely uh, respond. We'll start to see the temperatures increasing into the 80s, which is back up around average and then even warmer. Here's a look at our temperature trend over the next seven days. You know, we're not too far off the mark one way or another. Uh, our average high climbs to 84 on Wednesday and then up to 85 uh, by Sunday. It only goes up to 86 and then it starts coming back down. Uh, so we are just a little above and then a little below and then right about average on a couple of those days. So seasonable is what I would call that. Now there is a pretty decent, well, there's a little bit of a drop Thursday into, into Friday as a front moves through. That's going to pick up our winds a little bit and give us the chance of some mountain showers and thunderstorms and our uh, fire people are keeping a close eye on that. Overnight lows tonight mostly in the 40s and 50s. I, gotta, I meant to double check on that Deer Park temperature. Now they could, let me just double check on that Deer Park temperature right now. I couldn't do this on the air but I can do this when I'm on, on the web, I'm looking at, no, it doesn't have it there. I think that's a little low. Um, that's a little low. Um, I may bump that up to around 42. Our high temperatures tomorrow uh, in the 70s, 80s, and 90s, 79 in Sandpoint and Coeur d'Alene. That warmer air is working its way your direction, however. Here's a look at your planning forecast. Plan on just a bunch of really pretty days, day after day. That breezy should be on Thursday. Man, is it a Monday or what? I've got two things on my graphics that I would like to go back and fix. Well, I'm going to do that right now. Uh, well, it could be that I have vacation brain too because I am going to uh, get the heck out of Dodge uh, just for a few days. So you will be enjoying the meteorological stylings of Mark Peterson and Katerina Krasofis the rest of the week. And I'll be back next week to uh, find out if we're going to break that record for the latest we hit 90 degrees. We've never had a year where we have not hit 90 degrees or higher at least three times in Spokane. Three is the record low number of 90 degree days and um, we've been keeping records since 1881. 
the average number of 90 degree or higher days is 20. So, and we're long overdue. June 19th is the day of the average 90 degree or higher day. So I've got to go fix those graphics and uh, <laughs> send the outgoing email that says, I'm not here, and I'll see you next week. Have a great week. Maybe I will see you out and about. I will be the one very relaxed, wearing shorts and tank tops, enjoying the sunshine. <laughs> Thanks for watching.